Hello and welcome to this uh, quick tutorial to create a program which is probably the ultimate lazy person's hack with Python. Now, how many times, you know, using your computer, you've got like loads of tabs open, loads of programs open, you know, and you just really, really, you just can't be bothered. You really just cannot be bothered to close them all down properly. Well, I feel for you guys. So, this is a way to do it automatically. Not only that, just for an added bonus, I'm going to show you how to shut down your computer automatically as well. So, you know, you really just, you don't have to go to all of that immense effort of actually going to the start bar, you know, finding, you know, the shutdown command and clicking on that as well. This will do it all with a single press of F5. So, to work your magic, the first thing you're going to have to do is import OS. So, open up idle import OS at the top of your file. That will import the necessary module to use the commands, the operating system commands, to be able to close your programs down and also your computer. Now the print line, totally optional, I'm just doing that to tell, you know, to give me a little bit of warning that my programs are about to close. Don't need it, it's just there for, you know, a bit of info for the user really. Now these are the important lines of code for closing down your programs. Now you need this exactly as I've written it here, you know, os.system, you need the bracket, you need the spaces here between task kill and forward slash f and between im and the name of the executable file. Now this is the program that this line of code will close, it's Outlook in this case. This one will close, close down Chrome, this one will close down PowerPoint. Now, this isn't a misspelling on my behalf. This is actually what the PowerPoint executable file is called. So normally, you can just put the name of the program .exe and it will work a treat. Sometimes, however, you might need just to go to your programs file and have a look and just, you know, just check what the executable is called because sometimes it can be shortened when it's a longer word. So just, you know, if it doesn't work first time, go into your C drive go into your programs folder and just double check because like in PowerPoint's case it's a slightly shortened version of the full name. So you can add to this list by you know simply take this line paste it here and then change that for your most commonly um, used program. You can have the list as long as you want you know if there's 10 of your programs you normally have open you can put all those 10 in the list and it will simply close them down as soon as you run this file. Now finally, this line of code is the one that actually does the business of shutting down your computer. Again, the print, the print line, totally optional, it's just again, just to warn the user that their system is about to shut down. Now, copy this again, just like I've got it here, but the one that you might want to change, where I've got T1 here, that is telling, um, that basically means that the computer is going to shut down in one second. You might want to set that to five seconds or ten seconds, just so you've got a bit more time, you know, before the computer actually shuts down. But apart from that, there you have it: a quick, easy, and simple way to close all your programs, shut down your computer, literally by just having this file open and pressing F5. Now, I'm not going to demo this last line of code for obvious reasons it will cut my video rather short because my computer will actually close what I will do however is quickly show you you know I'll get PowerPoint over here got one open and show you that closing just to prove that this works so I'm gonna run the file I'm gonna have to quickly get PowerPoint back up I hope I can do it quickly enough there you go just about made it in time and as you saw PowerPoint just closed down it disappeared as the as the program ran now if you do this obviously don't have that line of code uncommented and your computer will also shut down word of warning though make sure you've saved any important work in your PowerPoints for example before you run the code because it will just shut them down without saving anything okay well have some fun with it experiment, try adding a few more programs, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye for now.